Hello. So I ordered from a website called the JList. I knew about this website for a, a long time. It's it's Japanese based, and a lot of the items come from Japan. And so I was always insecure about ordering from them, but I finally did. I did one item, and it finally came. I think it took like a month or something, or maybe longer, because I almost forgot about it. So um, I guess I'll share the items I got from the J-List. So the J-List, Japanese items, anime goods, otaku goods, you name it, like anything. All right, so I got a car captor soccer pin straight from Japan. And it's really, really cute. I really love the cloud key hanging off the end of the pin. cha -da! It came in this hefty box. Oh, by the way, the pin was $6 and something. Uh, yeah, $6 and something plus shipping. So it came for like ten fifty total. So anyway, it came in this box. I opened the box. The pin was wrapped up securely and bubble wrapped. So I was like, oh, they really care about my items so far. So I'm giving, I was like, oh, they get like five points already for like securing the pin. Then they put some extra stuff in here, like some free swag. <laughs> like anime eyeglasses. It's weird. But it's nice of this website for this company. Look, J-List. Or W O, oh, yeah, www.jlist.com or www.jbox.com. So the Jlist it says Jlist all products plus adult items. Jbox is for is a PG site. But oh, this by the way, another free little item, a uh, napkin, a cloth. That's nice of them. Some tissues. All right. So anyway. I'm satisfied with my purchase. Oh, and it looks like the photo, and I love it, and it's cute, and I'm a huge Car Captor soccer fan, and I'm gonna show you my other Car Captor soccer stuff. Well, not all of them, because I have a lot more, but I'll show you what I can because my room is messy. I'm on my porch right now. So I'm gonna show you how hardcore I'm a Car Captor soccer. Manga! Car Captor Soccer Mangas! Woo! The box set volumes, like the re released awesomeness from Dark Horse. Thank you, Dark Horse. My room is a total mess. Oh, yeah, the noise in the background is the air conditioner. My room is a total mess. So I'm going to make sure you don't see the floor, you don't see the bed. You're going to just see the Car Captor Soccer stuff that I can show you without trying not to show you my junky and artsy, messy room. So, I love Car Captor Soccer. I'm a huge fan. I'm obsessed. So, like, this cute plushie I love. I'm. Well, why did I pull up her dress? And another. I don't want to take it down. Her, uh, soccer plushie. Another soccer plushie. Oh, uh, where's Kiro? Where is Kiro? Oh, oh God, don't move. Okay, Kiro plushie is somewhere here, people. I don't feel like pulling it out. Figurine, like the little chibi figurine. Thought it was really cute and I had to get it. I need a showrun so bad. Um, the real good figure cost it like $50. Uh, the one where you can stop going in and out of focus. Sorry, everyone. Stay in focus. Alright. The real good figure. SH Figure Arts. Yeah, well, like it's bendable. I don't feel like taking her off the stand. And you can change her, um. Crap. Try not to show you my messy room. You see their face, facial expressions. You can change her facial expressions and you can change her hands on this thing. There's a Kiro, but he's on the thing. The SH Figure Arts figurine. Came in this box. This H figure arts. Sakura Kinomoto. It's really a great figure. And the inside of the box, <laughs> I don't feel like taking it out. 
Hold on, everyone. Box inside. Woo, and it's cute. But I took her out because I wanted to play with her. You can bend her. She doesn't stand in this one position, people. Okay, remember when... Well, actually, this is the, by NIS America. They re-released the Car Kept the Sakura episodes on, like, box sets. Three volumes of, box, of all the episodes, all 70 episodes. But remember back in the day, whatever, which company was it? Well, they, was re they were releasing in the early thousands the Japanese version of Car Kept the Sakura on VHS and on DVD. So the DVDs, they kept putting like, what, three to four episodes on each DVD? That was super annoying. And, um, and they were like 20-something dollars each, right? And they went up to 18 volumes. But before I could collect all 18 freaking volumes, <laughs> they went out of print. And they've been out of print forever, right? And then, so finally, someone was like, let's re-release it on a freaking simple box set. It should have been a box set earlier. And before, and um, this I got a while ago from a, not a bootleg because it has a, um, a dub. There is a dub for the second movie that they did over for this. Car Kept the Sakura, the movie collection. It's probably a time. Yeah, this is official. This is the official two movie. So Car Kept the Sakura movies. So the first movie, now this is interesting, now the first movie on here took place in the middle of the series, but Nelvana, Nelvana, is that what their stupid name is? The horrible dubbing company that dubbed Car Captor Soccer and changed it to Car Captors in the year 2000, they got their hands on the first movie to dub it. So they're, the Nelvana, Nelvana, whatever dub is for the first movie is on here but it's still it got the Japanese language on here so you can switch then the second movie was redubbed with better voice actors and voice actresses so there's like two different dubs for the movies on this collection and the unedited and the Japanese version is on here as well the car captain soccer dub I had a problem with everyone's voices except for Shoran and Sakura. And the editing was terrible. They edit stuff that they didn't even need to edit. They butchered that show where to the point where, I'll tell you, they butchered Karg after Sakura to put it on Kids WB or for kids, whatever, so much that they only came up to 39 episodes out of 70 episodes. It's 70 episodes in the original Karg after Sakura. And the dubbing, dubbing company just, they skipped episodes, they cut out crap, they just wanted Sh Lee Shoran, they wanted him in like every episode, so they cut out all the standalone episodes with Sakura, it's a girl show. If you can't work with this girly show, then don't, why dub it at all? It was like 95% girly, and they tried to make it like boyish, but that didn't work, because... You left so many questions unanswered for kids who watched the darn edited dubbed version. So, I'm just showing you my figures as I talk. But yeah, I'm so glad that that practice is kind of over. Like, where, Ameri where American dubbing companies just take an anime and destroy it. Because now everyone has an internet. Everyone can go online. So everyone can know the truth about an anime. Oh, I'm not really watching the same anime that I'm watching on TV. Now people can go online, they can go on websites, and you can watch. Uncut, unedited, undubbed, in Japanese, blah, 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 blah. Look, sailors, oh, Pokeboo, Pokeboo. All right, I have more Car Captain Sakura merchandise, but I don't feel like, yay, my favorite one. I don't feel like pulling them out. Um, this is a random video. I love Car Captain Sakura.